Hello, Jousters. Thanks for tuning in. This is the workout log brief for Thursday, May 7th. The workout today, every three minutes for eight rounds, you're going to do 20 second L sit, 30 total high knees, 20 second wall sit, 30, sec 30 total butt kicks, 20 second plank, and then 30 total seal jumping jacks. So that's just one round, we're doing eight rounds. And you're going to do this every three minutes. So the goal here is to have 45 seconds or more of rest, and you should be able to do all of these unbroken, except for maybe the L-sits. You should be able to do the first couple rounds of L-sits unbroken for the 20 seconds. But once you get to that halfway mark, if you need to break it up into two sets, that's okay. So even when you're getting fatigued in the last rounds, you should be able to hold your L-sit variation for at least 10 seconds. So you shouldn't have to split it up more than two sets of 10 seconds, all right? But again, the ultimate goal is to get at least 45 seconds of rest with going through these rounds and exercises. All right, so let's talk about the first exercise, the L-sit. So I have parallax, I know most people don't. So something you can do is put two chairs side to side and do an L-sit on the chairs. This is what the L-sit will look like. Here, you're gonna push down, try to hold your feet straight out. You can bend one, you can bend both. Those are options you can do. You could, if you have a pull-up bar, you could also hang from a pull-up bar and do the L-sit that way. Scaling variations, same thing. You can do two feet out, one foot bent, or both legs bent, if that's what you need to do. Make sure you're consciously engaging the core with whatever L-sit variation you're choosing. All right? So, 20 second L-sit. After that, 30 total high knees. Just like that. Try to get the knee at at least waistline, if not higher, all right? Those can be challenging, but I challenge you to go through them fast if you can. If you have an injury, maybe you just kind of march them out, all right? If you have someone coming, a new family member, maybe you kind of go out to the side and step out the high knees like that. All right, after that, 20 second wall sit. Pretty straightforward. You put your back against the wall and you sink down into a squat and hold it. I want you to treat that wall sit just like a squat. So I want your feet shoulder width apart, back flat against the wall, and you can do this, 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 but I don't want you doing this, supporting your weight with your hands. All right, don't do that. Keep your hands off your thighs. After that, 30 total butt kicks. All right. 30 total, so it's 15 each leg. Then, 20 second plank. Plank variations, just like always, you can go on your forearms, like so, or you can go up onto your hands, you can get on your tippy toes, like so. 20 seconds, try to do the one that is more challenging for you, that you can do with good form. And then after that, 30 seal jumping jacks. All right, so that's the workout today. If you can't do an L-sit, whether it's facilities for facilities, so if you don't have the equipment, or because of ability, you just can't do it, you can do a V-sit instead. So for example, a V-sit hold looks like this. You could also scale that by straightening your limbs. All right, that make it harder if you straighten your limbs out and try to hold it like that. Cool. After all of that, stretching we have, the mobility tomorrow will be 90 second hamstring stretch. So when you put your foot in the doorway, straight leg hamstring stretch like we have been doing every day this week, 90 seconds each side. 60 seconds couch stretch, and then three minutes straddle hold. All right, so for the couch stretch, we should all know this one too. But it looks like this, 
You can use a wall or a chair like this. Foot on it, knee down, keep your abs and butt tight, come up to really stretch the hip flexor. So you'll do 60 seconds each side. Straddle stretch, split the legs. It's three minutes, so what I would recommend doing is one minute here, one minute here, one minute here. All right, jousters, don't forget it is eight rounds of that. All right, so three times eight, 24. This is a 24 minute workout you are going to do. All right, jousters, don't forget your fitness challenges this week. So get your water in, get your stretches in. And if you haven't seen the at home hip circuit, scroll through the YouTube channel right now and find it because it's great for your hips. I've been doing it every single day. All right. Thanks, Jousters. We'll see you soon.